Now that I've drawn my, the size of paper that I want to use, um, I like to get this paper just to where I can just work with this paper. So basically I'm going to use this razor blade knife and this metal ruler, which you can see it has a cork on the bottom of it, which actually gives it space from the paper. And one thing that is good for is if you're, especially if you're using ink pens or markers, um, you've probably noticed when you do a line on a ruler that's flat to the paper, it smears. That little bit of space will prevent the marker um, from smearing the edge or the border that you're doing. But in this case, I'm going to use it for cutting out the paper. So I'm going to line it up on my outside edge and be very careful when you're using these these knives because they don't play around. They're very sharp. <laughs> so once I get it to where I want it, then I'm just going to set the blade at the corner and then I'm going to slowly put pressure and just drag it down while I'm holding the ruler in place to keep a nice straight line. Okay. And then I'll come over here. And for me personally, I like to pull the blade towards me, but slowly, because you don't want to, there's no rush when you're using this, this blade. That's the key point I'm trying to make. And then I'll do the same thing. I just set the ruler to the right, set the blade in the corner, and slowly drag. Okay, and you may have to score it a couple of times because it's a thicker paper. So it didn't separate. So all I'll do is repeat the process, which on this paper it usually takes two, two scores. I'll turn this one back and you can see that it's separated on the second score. I'll do the same thing on the long side and This one's going to be feisty, and I'm going to have to do a third one. And then, there we go. And this is being really feisty. There we go. So now this is the actual piece that I'm going to use. So I'm going to set that there. And uh, this drawing table actually has a cutting mat um, that I bought and put that on there to fit the size so it's like a self-healing and you can get that at your art store as well.